China here in the Egyptian capital city for the day six finals. It's the penultimate evening of finals and the last time we're going to see individual tournaments at these World Veterans Fencing Championships. First up, it's the gold medal match in the category C women's epee tournament. So it's going to be Amara Lisa Someroy from Finland, the number one seed, going up against Susan Uff of Great Britain. Maya Hashim of Egypt will handle the refereeing duties, supported on the video by Nunta Chanta Suva Nassassin. And the uh, two ladies here have worked hard throughout this tournament. Managing the last of the women's epee competitions here in the individual tournament. Field of uh, 22 in this competition. Samora came through the pool, dropping just three hits. Off by contrast, dropped two fights. She won two out of four in the first round. So contrasting days for the two. On a form, Samora up against Susan Uff of Great Britain, who has been building up in this tournament. British fencer who snatches the first hit. And the second has Samaroya collect the blade coming forwards, off just avoiding it. Left hander deceiving her opponent's attempts to try and find the blade. And this time launching attack into preparation so as Samurai went to take the blade in cart again another deception from Uff this time went forwards with her approach still the creator here she's still the one that's trying to fashion an opening and that's a lovely hit circular C speed up into taking the blade high and four stuff up into opening up the wrist and a really beautiful execution of that hit from the Finnish athlete and this time Uff attacking from too far away and a step back circular C's parry from the Finn and she's back within one Gone back to a bit more containment. It's on Samaroya to land the hit before more combativity is called. Oh, I'm pressing and just opening up the base of her arm.
So all square now. We won't see uh, non-combativity called in this first period. Just two periods of three minutes in uh, veterans' direct elimination at fight. And this, of course, is for the world title. Well, both of them had a shout at that one. Neither of them able to land, even in close quarters. For the first time, Sonoroya takes the lead. Classic FA Circle Cease down into the octave line, hitting on the leg of Susan, Susan Uff. And with just a handful of seconds left, this one will go to the break with the Finnish athlete in the lead. And they will go to their ends of the piece. Both athletes have support teams with them. Opportunity to take on some fluid as well. The interesting thing here now is that Samaroya, who uh, was pressing early on, has the lead. Uff was benefiting when uh, Samaroya was trying to create, looking for moments and openings as the Finnish athlete came forward. But now that she has the lead, the Finn, she doesn't need to take so much of a risk. A minute break as normal in D fights. And these are for this is a category for athletes 70 years and above. And you'd fancy these two being out uh, for the team event tomorrow. The last day of the championships tomorrow, featuring the men's and FA men's and women's FA team competitions. We're back underway here with Samora holding a slender lead in this gold medal match. Pressing through, it looked like Samurai actually had the advantage there, but she was unable to land her head over the top. It's very compact, Susan Uff. Not much of a target to hit. So now Samurai going back to that pressing game we saw in the first period. Discipline with that hand, just pointing the tip of the sword around the guard of Samaroya. And that's why she wants to be able to try and pick off doubles where necessary. At five apiece, target score of ten. Samaroya trying to show some target to us to get her to come out so that she can then react off that blade. That is her game plan. Oh, that's a lovely attack though. Taking the initiative. Maya, Lisa, Sumerova has uh, the uh, advantage now and just uh, half of this second period to go. Ah, and this time it's a nice attack from Susan Uff, taking the blade across the body, just forcing it out into the cart line from the left-hander's perspective, and then hitting somewhere around the uh, top of the leg of Samaroya. But Samaroya's worked out that this uh, binding octave, and then coming back out into cease attack, is working. Really 
just creating little openings and trying to tease up out into an attack so she can pick up her blade. And another beat attack from Uff. She's clocked, but this is the way forward for her. That's Samaroya. Have a little play around, show some openings. As long as Uff stays patient, she's just waiting for that moment. The blade settles down and then a very quick beat attack. So now Samaroya just ups the pace a little bit. And double. And again, that low line attack, or finishing in the low line, working well for Samaroya. She has been the creator here. Had a little quick look at the clock, seeing how much time she's got to kill to take this gold medal. And a double does it, as Uff is forced to come out on the attack with time ticking away. Samaroya pulls out the double in defense, and she is the 2019 Category C Women's Epe World Champion. Well, that's uh, one of three done for this uh, medals session. We'll take a short break in commentary uh, coming up next. The Category C Men's Epe Gold Medal Match. Don't go far. We'll be back for that. <laughs> 